one city, one artist, his music. Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart left numerous traces in Salzburg, in concert halls and opera houses the world over, and in the hearts of all those who have come to know and love his music. The Salzburg Mozarteum Foundation is committed to preserving Mozart's great legacy with the aim of integrating his music into the lives of people young and old. The foundation fosters the link between tradition and contemporary approaches to the composer through concerts, academic research and the Mozart museums. On account of its efforts, the traces Mozart left behind are more distinct now than they ever have been before. It was here that a genius was born 250 years ago. Young Wolfgang spent the first years of his life in this house at Getreidegasse 9 with his sister Nanal, his father and his mother. Surrounded by churches and mountains, the young prodigy heard his first musical tones here. It is also where he sang, played and composed the first notes of his prolific oeuvre. In 1880, the Salzburg Mozarteum Foundation first opened Mozart's birthplace to the public as a museum. Today it is both a tourist attraction and part of living musical history. When Mozart was 17, he and his family moved to a spacious new house across the Salzach River. The focal point of the house was the Tanzmeistersaal, the ballroom, where music was composed and played, and where guests were invited. The house was restored in 1996 by the Salzburg Mozarteum Foundation, according to historic templates, after it had largely been destroyed during World War II. Today it houses numerous exhibits, including a unique collection of authentic Mozart portraits. Since 2005, the collection is crowned by the last original portrait made during Mozart's lifetime, a silver point drawing by Doris Stock. The vault of autograph manuscripts of Mozart's residence and the archive at Mozart's birthplace are rich and indispensable sources of Salzburg's cultural history. Among the safeguarded treasures are a series of valuable historical documents, letters written by Mozart and his father Leopold, as well as over 100 manuscripts by Mozart including musical sketches, drafts and original scores. The Mozarteum's audiovisual collection is an exceptional resource for researchers. It contains roughly 17,000 audio titles on 4,000 cassettes and 1,600 CDs. In addition, the film department boasts numerous visual recordings with superb sound and picture quality, from the earliest silent films on Mozart to the latest documentaries, productions, broadcasts and other rare historical treasures. Since 1954, the Salzburg Mozarteum Foundation has been working on a historically significant project entitled the New Mozart Edition, undertaking the task of compiling the composer's complete works. Updates on the project are posted on an online publication. Working in cooperation with other strong partners, the Salzburg Mozarteum Foundation made all the texts and musical scores of the new Mozart edition available on the net. The free downloads preceded the release of the digital Mozart edition. The notes of Mozart's pieces are available for all music lovers to enjoy. The Salzburg Mozarteum Foundation is located in the Schwarzstraße, not far from Mozart's residence. It houses the Bibliotheca Mozartiana, the world's largest Mozart library, which contains approximately 35,000 titles. Die gesamte Bibliotheks- und Forschungsarbeit ist sicher sehr, sehr wichtig. Die Archivierung, auch die Sammlung von Mozart-Autographen und Wenn die irgendwo ihren Abglanz bekommt in der Praxis, dann finde ich das schon sehr wichtig. The Salzburg Mozarteum Foundation organizes concerts throughout the year, the highlight of which is the annual classical festival, the Mozart Week. I knew the Mozart Wacker was a very important institution. I didn't quite realize how 
significant an event it was and the roster of artists that appear at this festival is really formidable. Each January, internationally renowned musicians and Mozart lovers from around the globe meet for this spectacular occasion. With roughly 31 events in 10 days, Mozart Week has developed over the past 50 years into one of the most significant classical music festivals in the world. Each year, internationally acclaimed conductors, soloists, singers, orchestras and ensembles fill the Mozarteum's Great Hall with the rich sounds of Mozart's music. To be involved in, in a festival in, in Salzburg that's dedicated to him is of course um, something, something special and something we, we feel honoured to do. There's a kind of intensity. left its mark on Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart. He, in turn, left his mark on music. The traces he left behind should be preserved. In art, in Salzburg, in life.